What's up? Hola. How's it going? What's up, man? It's going good. Hell yeah. Oh, I'm sure. I just sucked into watching old ass videos of like uh, just the street life in the in the late 80s in like Chicago and Detroit. They're Fuck. cool. That rocks. Old like archive videos. I yeah, love those. yeah. I love uh, let me send you this link. Yeah, yeah. So it's set up like verses, but we're just gonna yeah, we're just gonna talk through. Just so it, we so. see the same thing, basically. Cool, cool. Oh man, uh, I'm psyched. So it's uh, like for anyone in chat who didn't see it, I was playing a bunch of Geo, and I didn't realize that low rank it just drops you in cities like exclusively. And then I ranked up and was just getting thrown in the middle of nowhere a lot and just getting fucking wrecked. So. Yeah, so we're gonna play on Community World, which I think is the map that you play no move on and like golden up anyway. Word, word. So let's begin. Hell yeah. I think you get all the settings right. Edit my call command. That's a sick avatar. I love that. Thank you. All right. All right. Since oh, since it's Europe playing, of course it's gonna be Europe first. <laughs> I don't. I've never seen anyone get more European locations than you. I swear to God. I, I get like exclusively Europe. Mm. I like too that the two times I got America drops, both were in Manhattan. Which is got all of that. <laughs> this is an interesting one. Mm. There's a lot of info to take in at least. Uh, these like these tile roofs. You see that a lot in Hungary. Okay. And the Romania border with Hungary as well, all over Romania actually, but I think we're in Hungary here. Okay. It, it might be some weird Slovak border stuff too. Yeah, yeah. This looks so Hungarian. And behind us, uh, sort of like, or to the uh, to the south east, there's some bollards right where that road turns. And oh, I yeah, yeah. Those are also Hungarian. Like now, this, the flag on this car too, the flag on this antenna, if you mm -hmm. look down at the, the car antenna, um, Oh yeah. There's a little little black flag little black on it. Flag. That's in a bunch of countries for generation three. And gener I'm probably going being getting ahead of myself here. No, it's generation not. three is a it's like the it's hard to explain once you're able to tell, but a lot of generation three coverage shows the antenna of the car, so okay. car meta can help. I don't like relying on car meta myself too much because I do like geo guessing, not car guessing. Not car guessing, yeah. But that's fair. When you get to a certain level, you got to use what what you can, like dual wise. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Especially if you're you finding have, someone else, they're gonna do it. So yeah, you can you can take time just playing geo by yourself to look at pretty places. That's what I also what I do. Yeah, and yeah. it's fun. I love that. I love uh, when you post just uh, like cool dogs on the side of the road and shit. It's oh best. yeah, that's great. So I think this would be just somewhere in Hungary. So you can just guess All wherever right. you want. I don't even know where it would be actually. I'll just throw it somewhere, somewhere near the border, like, probably. Right there. Cool, cool. Shit on you, dude. <laughs> I'm getting fucking owned. What is this? Ah, oh, man. I'm just glad I got it right. That'd have been embarrassing. <laughs> I do have the most GeoGuessr games played for American players in the world right now. That's sick. Hell yeah. I think I'm third overall, which is really pathetic. <laughs> uh, I fucking owns. I love that. Ooh, this looks kind of special. If I remember correctly. And I may not be because I'm kind of bad at this country. Mm. This is uh, Indonesia. Uh huh. It's kind of hard to tell at first between Indonesia and Malaysia when you start playing. Yeah, yeah. But these tiles right here, these red tiles, are super, super Indonesian. You almost never see them in Malaysia. And not only that, these red tiles are also huge meta for being on Java itself, okay. which is the big long part that contains Jakarta, Bandung, Surabaya, and all that. Okay. Are you talking about the red uh, tile roof? Yeah, sorry, cool. red tile roof. Yeah, yeah. The red tile roof is big for that. And then we have these to the um to the west, there's like that three pronged um utility pole. Yeah, yeah. And I think those are region specific. I might be wrong. Hmm. But if you if you if you go to the the south central part of Java, there's special region of Yogyakarta. Mm hmm. And I think it's somewhere in there. Cool, cool. So if, you, so if you zoom south central uh, of, of the entire, go, it's like south, keep going uh, keep going east of Bandung. Okay. And then where you see like Semarang up top, just go straight down from there and you'll see Yogyakarta. You gotta zoom in a little bit, it won't show up right away. 
You said uh, keep going east on yours. Keep east. Okay. Keep going east. It's it's bigger, but it's in the oh, south. Oh yeah, Central Java, Semarang. And then go down from there. You see Yogyakarta. Yeah, Yogyakarta. I think we'll be in there, but I might be wrong. I'm gonna plonk there. Yeah, yeah. Drop it in there. Yeah, close yeah, enough. Close enough. You'd crush people in like gold three or whatever with that guess. Yeah. You're yeah, closer I, than me there. I've noticed a lot of gold threes. Uh, <laughs> it's still not not all that hard of competition sometimes. Alright, all right, so this is a drop. I would always like lose my mind on a drop like this as soon as I see like the the brand brand lova. Brand lova. This guy loves brands. Brand lova. <laughs> brand lova, yeah. Um yeah, this is a bit this is a bit of a a funny one, but I think that sort of street label right there is, uh, I think it's only Czech, but it might be Czech and Slovak. Okay. Although, yeah, that would work for that too. But now I'm seeing, because it looks like the restaurant also has, uh, one of the languages on it. I'm trying to look for any more clues that would determine where else we, oh yeah. Dvorakovo Museum. So we should be Slovakia here. Yeah, Let's yeah. see. Where would that make sense the most, though? I don't know. I'm assuming the very bottom is maybe the name of the city, but probably... Maybe not. Maybe. Because I don't... See. I can't even really make it out. It might Provera? also just be... Oh yeah, Kominska. There's got to be some info there that I'm missing. This is one of those where it's like, if you're playing fast, you'll probably just 50-50 it with. But I also can't get over this red label, and I can't remember if that's actually mm -hmm. Czechia only, if it's also Slovakia. So one thing I also like to check sometimes, if it's mm -hmm. European, and I'm not sure which one. Uh, there's nothing helpful here, but sometimes Europeans love putting the their little country sticker on their card really in croatia you'll see hr a lot it means hervatska that's croatia in croatian okay okay so you'll see hr and they kind of do like croatians i can't think love it more than anybody but it does help yeah uh i don't know i really don't know if there's going to be czechia or slovakia i'm not i'm not convinced so just plonk it between them wherever you want yeah yeah it's one or the other right should Start be there it was just Czechia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was okay. That was the town, uh, Kolinska. That makes sense. Kolin. So I'm, I'm really not okay. good at Czechia cities. It's like a medium-sized city there. Nice. Yeah, that that whole area I struggle with. All right, damn. One of my one of my best geo friends, my first geo mentor, was like he, uh, not only just from Czechia but also like architecture expert. So I should know. <laughs> oh, that's sick. Uh, this is a cool one. Yeah, this cool. looks really cool. Cool location. Uh, it's probably very confusing at first. It yeah. Looks like too many things. <laughs> there's a lot going on. I see. There's, there's some a, things that help here. Sign. First thing you can do is point your compass direct north mm -hmm. and see where the sun is, and it's for sure north. So we're we're certainly in the we're like southern uh, hemisphere. Yeah. Yep. And then you can zoom on that uh, street sign. 12 de octubre. These signs right here, it's you'll get used to, to street signs eventually. It's yeah. a little harder, but these ones with the, the dark blue and the Spanish, very, very Argentinian. Okay. And Which is funny because not a lot of other Arge Metas here, but if you zoom in on that white car behind us, mm -hmm. there's this black thing in the middle, which they call the black dot. It's not really a dot. It's like a seal or something. On yeah, the thing, like, a, like a crest. That's, <laughs> that's one way to know you're in Argentina. Uh, only they have it, and it usually shows through the blurs, so it's super helpful. Cool, cool. So we do know we are somewhere in Argentina, yeah, on the coast, yeah, like somewhat far south. Now I'm trying to remember which one. Who had the hill there? I think it's further, even further south than you would assume. But I think it's uh, Comodoro Rivadavia, just from how the hills. Uh, Rivadavia. Oh, yeah, there it is. I think it's there just for how the hills, the coast looks right, and it yeah. gets really hilly right there. The hills are uh, so fucking. Cool. I'm gonna, I'm gonna plonk it there. And we were there. Beautiful. <laughs> it's 
So that's like the big thing in this game, especially in duels, is learning how to just take in everything you can around you. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes it's like nothing, like this round. Yeah. Like this round background. you don't have a ton to work with. And this is another weird one for me because I feel like I'm trying it's so pretty, yeah. Now this map right here is made by like all of the best pros who are also map makers. Mm. It's like a big group uh project and usually people from countries on it or pe like this whoever put made this location is probably from this country, which is cool. <laughs> that's cool. That's um, cool. It's all hand picked. But Community World is also that's the map we're playing on. Mm -hmm. It's also uh every single location is pinpointable if you're playing moving, which is like the special thing about it. That's cool. Which a lot of maps, not everything is pinpointable. Some of it's on like uh broken coverage and whatnot. Yeah, yeah. So a lot of thought goes into it. Uh that's awesome. Yeah, this is definitely the Alps. Mm -hmm. Um this big blur under the car is making me think this might be low cam. And low cam is only found in two places. Now the reason low cam exists is because Switzerland and Japan are uh we're having problems with the first generation of cameras that came through mm -hmm. and they were too tall and seeing into people's backyards. <laughs> so it was a privacy invasion. Oh wow. That was 2009. So they had to redo everything with lower cameras and that is why Japan and Switzerland have lower cameras, gotcha. which is also a good way to tell where you are. But sometimes when you're in hills on hills like this in the same area, some of Austria will look low cam just from the blur. So <laughs> it's either Austria close to Switzerland or just Switzerland proper. Gotcha. So I'll put it somewhere, somewhere along there. Yeah, I'll put it like, drop it in there. And it was just Austria. Oh, Austria, so, yeah. South of Salzburg. It wasn't proper low cam. Oh, I left healing on. <laughs> well, that's okay. We're not actually yeah, trying it'll to keep, it'll keep each going. other. Yeah. We're just gonna go to around a thousand. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> Okay, now this is one where you would get during a game and be like, fuck, what the fuck? Yeah, yeah, like I would, I would just shit? throw this like somewhere in like Southeast Asia and hope for the best. And you would be right. It is Southeast Asia. Um, nice. That's a weird sign right there. But I think with the center line, it should just be Indo. Uh, in Indonesia is famously one of the hardest countries still hmm. to region guess without putting in a lot of time to learn certain things about it. Yeah, yeah. It's still one of my worst countries, too. Uh, For some reason, I feel like this is like brand new coverage, too. That's not it's 2023 copyright. That's a really nerdy thing that some people do is copyright meta, but it's like... Yeah, yeah. It's only very specifically helpful. You have to know so much more about the game before that's actually like a really helpful thing, I think. Yeah, yeah. Like, it might, maybe it's like a little thing that helps you narrow down. Yeah. Yeah. The first things I look for is road lines. Mm hmm Road signs. Um... Obviously, like anything you see around you, like vegetation, will factor in as well. Yeah. But um, eventually you're gonna start noticing different like gra grades of pavement. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> and it's specific. Like there's hungry pavement. There's Illinois and Indiana specific pavement. And wow, once you so learn cool. what those things are, you're you're going to start recognizing them everywhere, and you're gonna feel like a crazy person. <laughs> and also, it might ruin some shows and movies for you because you're oh, gonna fuck. be removed. <laughs> you're gonna be taken out of the. I love that. Like I'm, full, I'm okay with that. I, I would. Yeah. I love that so much. It's kind of like if you know what Vancouver looks like, you realize that lots of shows and movies look like Vancouver because they're shot there. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Fuck. So I think this is going to be somewhere random in Indonesia. Uh huh. One thing I think is because that sign that facing away from us is uh, on the side of the road where if you were driving, driver side right, car gotcha, side left. Gotcha. You know? And then you can see a little bit of this red blur of the car on the line it's one mm -hmm. of the gen 4 indo cars i just don't know where i'm, I'm just gonna i'm just, just gonna throw slam it somewhere it. in there yeah i'll slam it in there yo what's up big al daddy and it Let's was just it. so I, I guess it is the java car i don't know if that's a real thing or not uh, i know it's a real thing but i don't know how far it goes gotcha gotcha <clears throat> Yeah, uh, Ice Cream Hendricks, I watched the GeoGuessr World Cup was a good reminder that I do not understand any of the metas. The, the, the unhelpful thing about it is they're always changing, too. Well, yeah, as <laughs> they, like, put new maps There's always out, right? new ones. Like, as they get updated. And... Yeah. I mean, that's the cool thing about GeoGuessr is you get uh, you get a lot of updates. You get a lot of patches. Yeah. You get a lot of DLC. 
Like last year we got we got lucky. We got Kazakhstan, and there that was published without any announcement or anything. Fuck. No one even knew it was coming. Just like this a... is indeed Turkey, by the way. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you, you can read the. Yeah, you're reading it. Um. So one thing you learn about Turkey is the Boyuk 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 Shahir Belediyesi yeah. is like city council or something. It's not a city itself. It just means like that's the. A lot of players spend a lot of time looking for those two words as cities because they do look like the city names. But gotcha, we're somewhere gotcha. called Sakarya. I don't know where that is. Okay. Uh, it's probably smaller. Thank oh, I, I found so it actually. Much, I, I literally just zoomed right on it. It's right uh, east of uh, Izmit. East of Izmit. So, kind of, Izmit's near. Uh, there it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Sakarya is right there. So it's somewhere in that district. That's sick. Oh yeah. God, Turkey is uh, fucking beautiful. We both went to the same spot, but it's, it's further north. <laughs> okay, that's actually the the uh, province name. The more you know. This is a a place I would like to go someday. I wish I just want to go fucking everywhere. Yeah, I understand. Yeah. So here's a really cool one. Um. Well, this. Is Spain really? This is this is the most southern part of uh of Europe. It's actually in North Africa, but it's a Spanish enclave. And I'm not sure which one this is. Let's look at the roads. But there's two of oh. them here. Like down by you go uh, south Gibraltar? of Gibraltar. Gotcha. Yeah, there's Ceuta, and then further down the coast, north of uh, Nador, there's Melilla. I think this will be Melilla just by how the road goes. Where was Melilla? Melilla is if you go if you go east of Ceuta. Mm -hmm. Say, which is the one south of Gibraltar. If you go further down that coast, down the east, you'll see the bigger city called Nador in Arabic. Then above that is Malia. And I think we're on the road, like much in the harbor down? south of that. I feel like a... I, because I am going west. <laughs> I'm looking west. I'm not going east. Oh yeah, yeah. That's what I'm doing. Keep, keep going. Keep going from there. Yeah, yeah. From where you are, and go all the way east. Oh, like out here, Malia. Yeah. I did not know these places existed. Yep. That's so sick. Damn. But yeah, just dropping it in there. Yeah, I think it's somewhere on that. Oh, it was just oh. too. Okay. <laughs> I didn't try to line. Oh, yeah, the, the, it's facing more south on that road. I didn't line it up. I am, okay. Like, my mind is blown by that. Like, it's... Uh, I don't know. I love a game like Geo because it's... I feel like that's a thing... That's a significant thing to learn. <laughs> that there yeah. Are, that there are yeah. those cities on North Africa. It's crazy. And and now we have an America round. An America round. Oh yeah, look at that. Indeed. Now tell me where Shit. you think this is. So I have never been anywhere in America that looks like this, but maybe Arizona. You have the right idea. Of being out west. Yeah, like we have this like high desert sort of brushy hills and stuff. Mm -hmm. I actually think though, and I could be wrong. I could be very wrong. I'm I'm bad at West US too because I've barely been there, but um. Yeah, I've only flown over. I, th I think this might be East Oregon. And I only say that because the, these yellow lines in the middle, mm -hmm. Oregon loves to have them wider apart than a lot of other states. There are some states that have them wide, Texas and Arkansas being two of them, but mm. this is not either of those. It's not either, yeah, yeah. So I think... I think... This will be somewhere like uh, on the 20 or something between Brothers and Suntex or whatever in Oregon. Yeah, yeah. The 20 is like between Deschutes and Malheur National Forest. Like, I think that lines up right. And I showed you how to line up roads, right? Uh, I actually, no, I haven't lined up roads. All right, so if you point your compass nor like directly north. Yeah, like hard north and look down. Yep, and look down. Your road will be facing in that direction. That's cool, that's cool. So it's going to be a part of the road that's like going slightly southeast. Yeah. And this is how you see GeoGuessr players, like, kind of plonk in the fucking middle of nowhere. Yeah, yeah. Pretty accurately, because some highways only go certain ways for a little bit. Like, it could be a lot of this stretch, I guess. Well, no, there's yeah, no stuff true. It could be any. It could be a lot of these places, for sure. Okay. Uh, and it might not even be Oregon, but I feel good about it. I'll drop it, like... We'll try it up here. That's further up. Near Unity, <laughs> Ironside. Yeah, I've, I've never been to Oregon. 
I haven't been to Oregon or Washington. Very pretty. I've been, only been to Portland. I haven't been to that part of the state. <clears throat> All right. That's another one. That guess right there, like, you usually crush somebody because they just wouldn't think about it. Yeah, yeah. Even a lot of really good players don't remember Oregon half the time for a location like that. I, uh, <clears throat> I, I find that a lot of the people I get matched against in gold, if I get, uh, like, like both New York cities I got, people guess Vancouver. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like was, oh really? Like, no matter what, if it looks vaguely American, they're throwing it in Vancouver. See, they've they're uh, they're they've learned everything looks like Vancouver after <laughs> Oscar. Um, they probably work in Hollywood. So here's here's a fun one. There's a lot of metas here. Yeah. But all these learning all the little the street signs and shit for urban locations that's boring to me. Mm -hmm. All the good players do that. I'm not one of them. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I don't learn like the exact differences in little street signs and stuff yeah you have a more fun meta at least on this location and that is beer meta beer meta you look at the bar right there i love that yeah yeah, yeah. Stadro, Stadro Pram and yep, yep. Uh, sign and that is a czech beer company love that and the architecture definitely works for czechia as well so i would go yeah, you've got the tile roofs somewhere big in czechia bigger i don't know if this is actually Prague. yeah not Prague. maybe like Pro Prague loves to say it's Prague somewhere, but <laughs> I don't. Maybe like and I think the street signs here, or in the big cities at least, are super, um, super specific. Like Hungary is like that too. Hungary, if you're really urban, mm -hmm. a lot of the street signs, at least the downtown areas, will be city specific design, which is cool. Gotcha, gotcha. I don't, I don't remember any of them, but I know they're specific. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm gonna put it somewhere. Yeah, I'll in the drop country. It in there. Ooh. Ooh, right on, right on Burno. Ooh. This guy <laughs> wants to knock me out. <laughs> Great guess. Oh, thank you, thank you. All right. Another, oh, another fun one here. Yellow plate, so it's Netherlands. Just kidding. We also <laughs> have the, the Grim Reaper here, but he has a Bart Simpson head. See that? Oh, shit. I do see the Grim Reaper. Is there another? I can't see him like straight on. No, I can't either. Oh yeah, look at that Bart Simpson. Facing away from us, but yeah. he's got a Bart Simpson head. <laughs> I think it's like a crown, but it's good. Um, this is an easy Portugal. Portugal. You read okay. that sign right there. Yeah. Anytime you see that that C with a little little tongue on the bottom of it, yeah. and you think it could be Spanish. But then you see the, the A with the, the tilde on top of it. Yeah, yeah. There's a good chance. But also, um, have you learned about the Portugal license plates yet? No, I haven't. So ignore the yellow plate. That's mm -hmm. probably someone traveling from France or something. But uh, the one in front of it, if you zoom in on the plate, you can see there's a yellow side on yeah, the right. Yellow side. Not just the blue side. on the left. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yellow is uh, Portuguese. Okay. Not going to be that helpful in a few years because I think they got rid of it this past year. Okay. So everything, everything, uh, it's like new coverage. It won't count. Yeah. Gotcha. I yeah. do love that about it. Like the, like, man, first time I played geo must've been like a fucking decade ago. Like just, just yeah. w whenever it came about, like whenever it was first hitting, I played there's, a bit. There's so, there's so much now. It's crazy. I love how much it's grown. Cause I remember back there feeling like, oh, I guess you just learn a few things, but now there's so much shit that it's like, I've, it's, it's one of the most impressive games I ever watch people play. Yeah. Definitely. Oh yeah. Um, so I don't know where this would be. I think it could be somewhere in the north central, in the like the river district. Uh -huh. I'm gonna I'm gonna look at cities for a second and see if I recognize anything. But I yes. Yo, what's up? This yeah, kind of has a feeling that it could be any sort of medium sized city in this country. Oh, Fel, Fel, no, it's Freg. I thought I saw, it, but I saw a different one. I thought Fel Felgere Felgerias. <laughs> Not what I need. <laughs> Uh, it's closer to a big city though, for sure. Hmm. But uh, I don't know where I'd w I'd want to go with this. Hmm. I'm gonna spin it around again. Anytime we have these hills, though, uh -huh. eh. Anytime we have these hills, I gotta put it near near the Douro. I think the Douro is the big ass fat river that cuts. The country in half, kind of where Porto is. I feel like it's be somewhere up there. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. 
I just like it because the hills. We'll see. You put whatever you want, though. I'll throw it, uh... I hope it's on an island. It's right here. That's where the hills are sus. Alright, it's further north. Oh, there it is. Vinais. Vinais. Yeah, yeah. I'm so, uh... I hate feeling like... Like, the ignorant American. Who, <laughs> like, doesn't know any other languages and can't differentiate languages. That's, that's a part of yeah, what that's I all learn learning this about. It's, yeah, yeah. That's all it's all about. It's all good. This is a cool one. Um, so we have a we have this yellow plate in front of us. Uh -huh. Very, very British location. Mm -hmm. But I don't know how... I don't know where British. I yeah. have to think about this. It seems like it could be one of the... Uh, the big parks, the national parks, um, the rock walls make you want to go like n north of York, like in North York Moors. Mm -hmm. But it's hard to say. I can't remember all the places I've seen these rock walls. I think we could be even further north up into Scotland. This is a another tough rural one. Yeah, yeah. Um, one of my friends is like. He's from Wales, and he's un he's just unlocked the UK. He's so good at it. <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh, I don't remember how far these rock walls stretch, though. Right. You ever listen to uh, McCluskey or Future of the Left? <clears throat> uh, no, I don't think so. A band from Wales. Cool fucking band. But uh, I'm in love with that accent. Love that accent oh, so yeah. much. Yeah. You could hear it come like, through. Harry's got a great accent, too. Hell yeah. Some of the shit he says is just so Welsh. <laughs> Undeniably, um, well, pick somewhere in the UK that you that you like. So, welcome to I'm something gonna, complex. It might I'm just say it's the. Instead. Thank Maybe you for driving sessions. safely. This could be even further north with all these rocks and these trees on. Put it like up here. We'll see. Yeah, it was it was oh, just cool. like it's hanging out in there. Lake District House, they're so cool. I'd feel like a wizard if I lived out there. <laughs> <clears throat> Ooh. All right. Here's a fun one. Any guesses? Uh... Don't worry, there's no bad guesses. You're learning right now. Yeah, yeah. So normally, like, I would get a drop like this. Okay. And then start to look around in areas I think it could be. And try to like match the way the, you know, like lettering looks. See if it matches the uh, the name of an area, you know. Yeah. But uh, uh coffee here's, juice. Here it's even easier. Is this like uh, what is it? Jordan. Yep. Okay. Cool. It is. This is indeed Jordan. I don't know. Man, this could be Max. North, like in Jarash. I think that might work. I don't think it's. I don't think it's Amman proper. I would mm. see bigger buildings, wider roads in this area. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, um, and yeah, here it's it's pretty easy at least. If it's between like Jordan or any other Arabic-speaking country, there aren't many of them in Geo. Yeah. If, if it's Tunisia, you'll also have French usually, mm -hmm. which helps. Yeah. Here we see none of that. Here is just pretty much Arabic everywhere. Yeah. Some English, and uh, if it's like UAE, well, that's pretty easy to tell because yeah, it's, it's so flat there until you get to the north uh, east, mm -hmm. and it also just just if it's the older different. coverage there. It's 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 white car. You'll never see this black car in uh, UAE. Okay. And then the other thing is. Um, there is coverage that would look like this in the West Bank, uh -huh. but that car would have a long antenna on it. Okay, okay. So, so black car, no antenna with Arabic, usually going to be almost always Jordan. Okay. Yep. And you were thinking so, maybe up by Jarash? I, saw, I, don't, I don't actually know. This could this could be any of the big city districts. Although it's yeah. enough, I'm just going to put it there. Yeah, I'm going to throw it up that way too. I saw Jarashi on another sign. Yeah, it is there. Cool. Noise. Terrible at recognizing Tunisia. Yeah, it's one where um, if I'm playing NMPZ, which I usually do, it's when you no move, no pan, no zoom. Like, uh, 
Tunisia is the one where I'm like, what the what the fuck could this be? Till I remember Tunisia exists. I'm like, yeah. oh yeah. Dad jokes rule. <laughs> so that, that's what that uh, billboard says behind us. Let's see. Beautiful. Ooh. <laughs> we have a five cable location here, sir. So is this, uh, well, it's Oklahoma. You see yeah. that sign too? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 95 in Oklahoma. So, so we're off the 95 in Oklahoma. We also have a railroad running uh, just north of us. And then we have a place to the south called Hometown Inn. Oh, beautiful. So all we need to do now is find Sweet. the 95 in. Looking for the 95 in Oklahoma. In North Dakota. And now one thing to remember is you see how some of the white, like w before you zoom in all the way, you'll see some of them are, uh, they have like the, the shield instead of the circle. Uh, the shield one is always yeah. one of the U.S. routes. If you go go to your map. Mm -hmm. Oh, circle and shield. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. So, so if there's a shield on it, that's a U.S. route. You're looking for the number that's just in the circle. That's a state route. Oh, okay, okay. There's 99. Uh, there's usually no order to it, right? In terms of not, like, like no, not, not yeah, not usually. Although there is an, an order to um the interstates, how they're numbered. Mm -hmm. They start high in the northeast and they go low as you get more southwest. Gotcha, gotcha. That's why I have like the five out in LA. This seems like it's going to be... 95. Sometimes these are hard to find too because they'll be, um, they'll have a shared, a shared number yeah, with yeah. something else. So they'll have it like overrule it. So 95 won't even show up. It's really annoying, but... You're, you usually won't have this much time in a duel anyway. You just hope you see that Oklahoma sign and stick it somewhere and pray. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm doing a bad job at finding the 95. I have also not found it, so don't feel bad. Well, I'm about to find out where it is. Let me just quick another scan. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I do if I'm doing like uh, timed time oh, to run trying to found it find it yeah yeah where at it's uh in like the northwest corner right below elkhart in uh in kansas oh straight line little tiny 95 oh yeah it is little this is what a hometown in it is whittle that's where it curves we're by, east. The, we're by the junction too are we actually on the 56 and we're coming up on the 95? That would kind of work for this. The hometown inn's just not showing up. I think we might actually be on the 56 the way this is running. Yeah, yeah. That would make sense. Yeah, because it's going northeast, yeah? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't see the hometown to, inn. But there's the train tracks. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's the other thing. It's the railroad. It's going to be somewhere along there. You'd expect the hometown in to pop up because there's so little here at so many of the stops, but yeah. Well, it's, I mean, it's going. It makes that it like goes hard pretty far. Curve right ahead. That's gotta. It's gotta be something, right? That wouldn't be all the way back now. Yeah, and then eventually the railroad track goes to the south of it too, after Dodge. Let me check back. And there's like no other cross streets or anything over here. Well, there's one back here, but no, nah, this is like a driveway. Let me check back to where the 95 crosses. Is it really just right here? I'm trying to see where this, I can't read any of the other street names. It's a bit of a town behind us. Hmm. I guess we're just coming up to 95. I guess it's just the one that's... Are we really at the state line, though? It can't be. Because... Hmm. I think we're at the town just before... I don't even know what it would be. <laughs> Let me see. Sturgis. Every single intersection I found where it should be, there's mm -hmm. no inn, and there's no building for the inn, which is weird. Yeah, it's just, like, empty. Yeah. 
Oh well. Put it somewhere on there. <laughs> Moving on. Yep. Ah. Oh, we're there's the 95 going the other way. I guess I should have looked which way. Oh, going. fair. That's fine. That's funny. <laughs> okay. Hmm. A little weird one here. Yeah. Okay. I think this is a this is a weird little Uru Uruguay. Ah. Although mm, yeah, I kinda like that. It might just be Arge. But very, very red All the soil. Poles are Uru. Yeah. And then it looks like some sort of little um resort area to our southwest, like those cabins. Those triangle buildings. It is like this place is advertised like a hotel. Their jacuzzi, TV, video, audio. Damn they have audio here. Where do you see that? Oh on the side of it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you get used to reading things at an extreme angle too all the time. Mm -hmm. Um, I feel like it's. I don't know why. I feel like it's gonna be Uru, but near, uh, near Brazil. Okay. It's very hilly too, but Uru gets a little hilly. Weird place. Actually, maybe I'll go further south. Anyway, I'm. I'll put it Uru. Kind of hedged. Right there, right there. For both my ideas. Yep. Mellow. I swear I've seen that location before. Not location, but just that road. Yeah, yeah. Seven times damage. Hmm. <laughs> Lovely. Okay. You have some nice metas here that you will never forget. Okay, okay. Any, any guesses? Uh, oof. Not really. <laughs> I got a speed limit 45 sign. Which makes me think it's... Well, what's with the street sign? Like, what is that to the left on the street sign? So that is a uh, probably city or county specific. Sometimes this is in the U.S. The and this is California. Have you come it's California. And now, I will, and now I'll tell you why. Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, it looks like California, first of all, but... Uh, there's two things you can look at. First, look between the in the yellow line on the road. There's yeah, that black line in the middle. Super oh, yeah, California. Yeah. Okay. Some other states have it in like random spots, but very, very California. Mm -hmm. And then it's hard to see on the pole closest to us, but if you zoom the pole to the north, uh, the utility pole. Yeah. The the lighter brown one. If you zoom, you can see those three yellow stripes on it towards down by the fence. Oh yeah, yeah. Um. Those three stripes are also very right. California. Sure. They do appear in Oregon sometimes, which is really baity. And there's locations that have popped up in like World Cup events that are actually in Oregon, oh, <laughs> damn. despite it being a California <laughs> pole. Um, kind of a weird one where this is. Like, I feel like it could be pretty close to LA, mm -hmm. but I feel like it could be further deceptively up the coast, closer to the Bay Area, but not yeah. quite. So I am going to put it now. Mm, no, I think I could commit with those hills. Hard to say. And I don't know that actual, I don't know that street blade, what that logo is. It, it would be really helpful if I did. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> huh. What do the stripes mean? I think they just uh, reflect. I think they're just reflectors. People don't hit them. Gotcha. I don't know. Huh. I will... I will hedge. I'll hedge my thoughts. They may... This may be even way further south towards the border. I'll throw it out here and see what happens. And it is oh, further yeah. south towards San Diego. Nice guess, bro. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what time zone? I'm uh, Eastern. It's 2.30 right now. Okay. All right, Justin, you want to tell everyone where we are? 
like? Because <laughs> I don't fucking know. No, it's one of those locations where uh, all I can tell you is it's Europe. Okay. And the and only is... way I can tell you that is because this little dongle antenna. Oh, okay. okay. Uh, I see that. I'm between like a. I'm between like an Austria, Slovenia here. Hmm. My ass would wind up every time I'm in. I don't know where I am in Europe, and I see thin trees. I'm like, it's probably Finland. And I just throw it in Finland. There's a trail marker painting to our right too on this branch, but I don't know what it means. And uh, don't let the red and white fool you. Okay. Because it can be anything. Yeah. I don't. I just don't know what it means. It's, it's something for more for people that live around here, and, it, and that can change from like part of a country to the other part of the country. Yeah. Um. I don't know. This is generation three. Mm -hmm. With these hills and trees, I wouldn't go as far north as like Sweden or anything. Yeah, yeah. I would. I'm gonna put it right on, like the border of Austria and Slovenia. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. I'll join you there. It could be somewhere. Okay, and it was just Slovakia Czechia border. Hey, yeah. it was border. Slovakia would have been my other guess as well. Word. So, um, usually. If if you're between like a Slovakia and Czech, uh, Slovakia and Czechia, I guess like that in the middle of nowhere, mm -hmm. it's it's more hilly. Uh, Slovakia is probably your better bet. Word. Sounds good. Now there's another one that looks really annoyingly impossible, but there's a lot here to go off of. We are driving on the American freedom side of the road. Uh -huh, uh -huh. We have the sun. The sun's actually deceptive here, but where we are is also deceptive for the sun because. We're just north of the equator. We're in Colombia. Ah, Colombia. If you have you learned the Colombian cross yet? No, I've not. So if you look at the back of all these street signs, there's that big bracing cross on it, and that is uh, Colombia only. It will pop oh, up every yeah, now and yeah. then, but it's very. It's like one of the first things people learn when they start learning metas. Huh. Uh, it could save you a lot in South America. Yeah, yeah. Because it kind of is just on all the signs, and also, uh, they love their white the white sign poles in this country as well. Okay. You'll okay. see those in the, the backs of the signs will almost always be white. Whereas Brazil, they're usually black. Huh? Damn. And then in uh, Ecuador, they're light blue sometimes. Oh, also cool. We have like a, um, a Panther crossing sign to our yeah, right. Yeah, I saw that. Very cool. That is extremely cool. <clears throat> so I don't know my, Colombian, I don't know if anybody knows their Colombian telephone numbers, so that doesn't help me. Mm -hmm. All I know is we're on a split highway. Uh, a little tropical with the trees, but that can be sort of anywhere, too. Yeah, yeah. Um, I don't know. It's like... I don't think we're quite east of the Andes, maybe just west of them. Mm. La Esmeralda. Or we'll be somewhere max north. Somewhere very north. I have no idea. Put wherever you want. There. Let's see what happens. Oh, it's <laughs> right. just right in the middle. Oh, it's Barranca Barmea. I think that sign actually says something about it. Just put the Barranca part. Nice, nice. And some of these locations will hopefully come up in your duels, and you'll remember because yeah. we're <laughs> moving over them. <laughs> Like if you just want to cheese a little bit too and get better at your duels, you could play a community like community world, just not duels and yeah, and just just get good with the just kind of learn what stuff is. Through it. Yeah, nice. We're back. We're back in North America here. Yeah, a little little bit of snow there. Oh, it's it's Tennessee. Tennessee. Believe it or believe it or not. Yeah. Really. Mm-hmm. Damn. There's this, this, uh, their stadium over there, the Vols. It's the only thing that gave it away to me. Yeah, I know it had to be something like that, but the winter oh, coverage the, uh, throws you off. Like that, uh, big globe up there? No, look, the top of the, uh, the stadium. Oh, if yeah, you zoom sure. in. I didn't see the stadium. Yeah. Yeah. Vols. Yeah, yeah. Damn. So now we gotta find, uh, what bridge we're on, I guess. And do they play Nashville? There's no way this is Nashville. It's too small. No, it's Wait. Not, uh... Okay, I know it's not Memphis either because I don't see the fucking. <laughs> Is it Knoxville? <laughs> it has to be, yeah. Knox yeah, yeah. Vegas. That's right. <laughs> There's yeah two bridges here. I have to say Knoxville is a city that I just 
almost never see in GeoGuessr. It's weird. Yep. I literally see Pigeon Forge more than Knoxville. <laughs> this is the Henley Street Bridge, huh? Yeah. I'd rather be on Gay Street, though, if I'm be honest. <laughs> yep, yep. The other one's the Gay Street Bridge here. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Let's go. I remember right. uh, being a kid and going to DC. Ooh! The 5K. I mean, we both did, but... <laughs> nice. Being a kid driving through DC and seeing uh, Gay Street is losing my mind. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a nine-year-old. There's a Gay Street, too, when you're going across the uh, PA border into New York on whatever interstate that is. Hell, yeah. There's, like, an overpass that'll say Gay Street, and I'm always like, ha! <laughs> Gay! <laughs> All right, here's a... Hmm. That's what I think it is. Yeah, I guess it counts as a split highway. So another fun thing, mm -hmm. we're back in Jordan. Our, back our in buddy Jordan. Jordan. Okay. And one nice thing about Jordan is there's only one highway that's split there like this. Okay. That highway is the 15, the 15. which runs yeah, yeah, there it is. from Mon all the way north to uh, Syria. So we're gonna be on sort of a northwest straight stretch i think i think this is south of hashem hashemaya and north of man could be wrong though huh. something like that yeah, yeah i think this counts as a split highway it's usually the divider is wider than that nice it's just north of it oh yeah tafila government was it the split highway that gave that away down. Or like along with just like the uh, I, I saw the, the Jordan car right away, and I mean, this, the desert makes sense, but yeah. um, yeah, the split highway you just automatically just try to line it up because it's only going to be there. Well, this one's kind of <laughs> uh, this one's kind of easier. Yeah, yeah. I don't know where this fort would be, but I mean, oh yes, you will. It's on the, just keep reading signs. Yeah. You'll see. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's in New York, huh? <laughs> I'll be a place I've not heard of in New York. Ticonderoga. 74. It's where they, they make the good pencils. <laughs> I was in a really part, pretty part of New York this weekend. Yeah, where, way, where were you is like, uh, it's way up north, by the way, on, on uh, like the Vermont, New York border. Oh, wow. All the way up uh, Adirondacks type. Oh, okay. If you go straight up north of Al Albany and then Lake George, you'll run into Ticonderoga. Fort Ties somewhere around there. Oh yeah, I found it. Are we on Fort Ty Road by we're by the railroad tracks? Oh yeah, there it is. <laughs> I'm still just looking for 74 up around there. Uh, you said by the Vermont border? Yeah. So if you go, if you go all the way to the south of Lake Champlain, Ticonderoga is all the way at the bottom of that too. I'm gonna ask. You're just on it, right where your cursor oh, is. Was just, just like now. up here. Keep going, keep going right where you're just worth a, a yep, that's the lake. Go to the very south of that. that where it turns into like the river. Door, okay. And you'll run into it. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. And Ticonderoga is at the top of that. And you'll see the 70, uh. <laughs> keep going at. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Yeah, right at the north of Lake George. The very tip of Lake George. Very tip you're, of Lake George? Yeah, you're just, you're just on it. Oh, yeah, there it is, there it is, there it is. I went to Lake George once. When I was very young. There you go. Yep. So somewhere around there. Cool, cool. I would assume. I'm just gonna look real quick. I was at like a campground right around here. It's uh, when I was like 12 years old. Nice. Oh, nice. I had a 5k. <laughs> <laughs> 67. But yeah, that's what's cool about this map too is uh, a lot of pinpointable locations if you get lucky. Yeah, yeah. Everything's pinpointable, but sometimes you have to move to find it. <laughs> sometimes you don't. <laughs> um, another fun European round mm -hmm, with mm -hmm. that little, a little antenna. With yeah. that, that little antenna. This is a weird one. I think this might be like a. There's something strange about it. Hmm. It feels French. The fence works for that. I just don't think the house does. Yeah, oh yeah, I guess the it could. Way off. Mm, maybe like I'm gonna put it in France, like near 
Lux Belgium ish. Okay. I could be way off. Look at these houses. Nah, I'm okay with it. It really could be Czech again, to be honest, but. Yeah. Gen 3 Czech and Slovak are like, uh. Pretty baity at times. Mm -hmm. There's nothing else indicating. No other signs. I'm okay with it. Yeah. Da -da 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 -da. Put it out. Let's put it out. One of those. All right. <laughs> it was France near Belgium. Yeah, I gotta get better at spot in France. But those fences are a bit of a giveaway, huh? That, that's a tough ass. That's a tough ass uh, location. Yeah, for sure. All right. It looks like we are forty-three kilometers north of Kajani. Take it away. Oh, where man. are we? No, I'm just kidding. See a <laughs> sign up there by the the road? You can sort of see where it says Kajani. I assume yeah, it says Kajani. Kajani. That is in Finland. All the way up um, southwest of Ulu. Southeast, sorry. There's nothing southwest of Ulu. It's water. <laughs> and shore. Uh, Kalani's pretty big, though. If you if you go all the way up halfway, like through the entire country, and then mm -hmm. see Ulu, and then go southeast of that, Kalani's on the big... Uh... Oh, yep. Yeah. Johnny. Carter who sounded me. And we are like 43 kilometers in a city north of that. So, something like here in Salmi or Ristiarvi. I'm so bad with what the distance is. Uh, yeah, me too, to be honest. Sometimes I just get lucky. I'm going I'm to pop it down around there. I'll throw it up here. Ooh! Ooh. <laughs> I picked the right one. Yeah, it's a nice one. You're hanging on for dear life now in yeah. round 23. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you for my the pronunciation uh, compliment. I try. <laughs> I'm, I don't think I'm very good at any of them, but... All right, here's a weird one. Here is a weird one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, uh... I got nothing um, on this one. I can't see these signs properly, but I I reckon they have a CH in front of the road sign. Now there would be a few places that would have a CH in North America. We know it's North American because that beautiful Ford behind <laughs> yeah, us. Yeah, yeah, that beautiful pickup. Uh, <laughs> this is Canada, and it's going to be uh, Northeast Canada, like the Maritimes. Okay. I believe. I could be fucking just telling lies right now because some of these trees are sus behind that house. They're, they kind of remind me of Manitoba as well. Mm -hmm. But... Do I trust that there's actually a CH on these blue signs? Hmm. I think... So here's something that uh, I love to tell Canadians, because some of them don't even know. Uh -huh. There's only one place in Canada that by law has to have English and French on its signage, and that is uh, New Brunswick. And I think with this sort of... I, think I might be gaslighting myself with the dirt, but I feel like it could be New Brunswick across from uh, Prince Edward Island. I also could just be lying, and this could just be Quebec. Oh, Quebec. It could just be Quebec, for sure. What do I trust? <laughs> what do I trust? I don't know if I want to trust this road for Quebec, though. It seems way more New Brunswick, Nova Scotia. Yeah, yeah. But I can't read anything, so... Maybe I'll be all the way wrong. Throw it on out there. No. Or I'll be right fucking on the right road. Almost <laughs> the right it. road. Okay. All right, fine. I promise I haven't seen that location before. <laughs> Yo, JHK. Got my ass. What's up, dude? <laughs> what's up? What's up? All oh, right. Man. We'll run it again. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is... Uh... That's right. Quebec is French only by law. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is dope. So this is... Uh... I would guess somewhere in Africa, right? Just based off trees. That would be a decent guess, but... Mm -hmm. I think I'll say no because of the car we have. Ah, okay, okay. This, this blue car. 
This blue car is very... It's very sus for here. <laughs> but also... What is this brush? It's one of these... This is one of those locations where... Uh, surely it's just a weird arge. Hmm. And the reason I say that is... Uh, well, a few things. This fence, that pole, that pole mm -hmm. to our uh, east, and all east. the poles actually. But this brushiness does look so many look like so many African places. Yeah, yeah. But I think with this car and where the sun, where it is, this should be somewhere. Oh yeah, yeah. Somewhere in northern Arch, but I don't know where. I haven't practiced arch in a long time either, so there could be other dry spots I'm forgetting. Hmm. These hills are bothering me though. Like, is the sun just, is the sun tricking me? <laughs> hmm. Can I look at the houses again? Hmm. I can trust it. Yeah, that's also what I was what I was thinking. Like, S S D. Mm. I trust that. J H K. By the way, John Harvey Kellogg in chat is one of the uh, who I would consider one of the best players in the world. Oh hell yeah! Happy to have you. A big, big old map head like me. <laughs> also, one of the rare uh, American players. <laughs> <laughs> what is uh? What hell is S D? Yeah. SD is Santiago del Estero province, north of Cordoba. In, okay. uh, and I think it'd be like the sort of the north of that, where it gets a little hillier. Or actually, maybe in the middle, too. I'm going to oh, put it there around there. Yeah, yeah. Drop it in there. You're killing me. <laughs> nice. It was La Punta. Thank you. Salute. Thank you. You remember that? If you remember that brushy stuff? That's like a pretty safe place to uh, go with it. Okay. In Arge, which is nice because Arge is annoying to learn. Yeah, yeah. Okay, here's a country I don't know a whole lot about any of the meta, although this instantly looks like Hokkaido. Yeah, I was gonna say this is a. Uh, it's definitely. It feels certainly north. We even have that pine behind us to the south. So one thing about Japan that is good to learn. Mm -hmm. There's a lot I haven't learned, including the transformers at the top of the poles. Yeah. But there's also halfway down the pole, there's those placards. There's the yellow one and the white one on the utility pole. Uh, if you look to our, um, the one to the west, closest. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, these, these. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And I think that yellow one, that one is Hokkaido anyway. It's an old city. We do have, also above us, we have a really nice sign with roads and city names and everything. Yeah, going up the eight. Yep. All the Betsu. Where's Hokkaido? What's wrong with me? Chibetsu. Hokkaido is the, the island to the north. It's the north the island. North, okay. Yeah, the yeah. north island. Collectively. These are all things where... Let's see the eight anywhere. Eventually, you'll never forget them. Mm -hmm. I, I also have to always, like remind myself when uh when people are newer i mean even when i'm streaming geo i'm so bad at like teaching because i just so many things are just second nature at yeah that point. yeah i'd imagine what are the ones i need 243 364 and the eight does eight even run up here though i didn't see the eight up there i'm yeah. oh, sorry just look at the there are different shapes on them there's like the triangle oh, ones and the hexagon sure. ones yeah yeah so Oh, the hexagon ones. Make sure you have the right deeper. shape. Yeah. Yeah. Otherwise, you'll be looking for days for a number that was right under your nose. Damn. Oh. Am I tripping? I'm just going to look for a second. Yeah, yeah. Just going to look for a second. Nah. <laughs> Where's the cabbage, though? <laughs> yeah. I think we have just the normal guy wires too. So the guy wires are the the lines that hold the poles up. Uh huh. 
A lot of people say guide wires, but they're actually guy wires, like G E Y, G U I, not G U I. Oh, like like guy. <laughs> the guy wiring. It's Love a weird a word. It's a weird weird uh infrastructure word to learn, but engineers probably know it. Anyway, I'm gonna put it somewhere up there. I don't really know. Just where. throwing it up there. I'll throw it up. There. Yeah, I like all of the best two towns. Okay. Oh, it's all the way over there. There we yeah, are. There oh, is. and the eight's tiny. It's a so tiny, far, tiny white yeah. road. Yeah. 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 Usually the, the hexagon roads are much, much smaller. Okay. Hard to see. I really wasn't trying scanning because we're just having fun anyway. <laughs> Ooh. That's cool. This is a this is a weird one. A weird little a weird little old trucker. Huh. This is some uh this is some I th I think it's an India trekker. Oh yeah, I sort of, sort of see. weird though. So, the shitty thing about India coverage now is it's covered with a camera they use that was cheaper to use in third party. Uh huh. Which was which gives us worse image. So usually when you see an India location, it's going to look a lot worse than this and not as clear. Uh -huh. It's called shit cam. Okay. They use it in other countries too, but India is the one where it got most coverage with that, unfortunately, because India is such a cool country. Yeah. So it yeah. sucks that it's like it's like that. Yeah. But back in like 2017 and a few other years, they brought cameras on backpacks, like the the tripod cameras, nice. and uh, covered a bunch of areas. I can't quite read what that sign says, even though some of it's in English. Yeah, the, well. like the, the the plaque. This is some sort of. Um, some sort of yeah, park or tourist attraction. Now there's really no way to like there's really no way to know where any of this shit is. Yeah. Unless you've looked at all the trekker coverage or the tripod coverage. Mm. Shit cam used to be US and Australia. Now that was Gen 1, which is different from shit cam. That was just how bad the camera was in two thousand eight. <laughs> shit cam is all is still being used and it looks bad. Yeah, generation one and shit camera are, are different different ideas. I know what you mean though. <laughs> um, let's see. I think I will go. I'm literally just looking around. You're looking at like mountains, <laughs> like China. That's the thing too that I've learned playing India. I used to always go just north for the mountains because that's where they were. Yeah. But damn, they got some they got some hills in India all over the place. Yeah, yeah. I looked at all of the coverage. I don't remember seeing. Yeah, see, if JHK hasn't seen this, I feel better because I don't think I've seen this. Uh, I'm still gonna go where I think it looks like. Maybe I'll be wrong. Mm -hmm. I'll put it up here. Ah, oh, way out there. It was Araku Valley. There's a coffee museum there. Ooh. I gotta get new beans. I got no coffee beans right now. No! I'm all out. How are you even awake right now? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, this is a cool one. Um. Really nice. I love like uh, God, like just all the vegetation. This area. Yeah, right? so the drivers sick. that the drivers that drive roads like this are my hero. Yeah, I'm a big I'm a big rural location lover. Mm -hmm. Not not because I don't think cities are cool. I just think at some point cities get too easy for how good people some people are. Yeah, and I yeah. just I like seeing rural life through like the candidness of the Google Cam. I think. Yeah, it's cool. You it's, guys doing uh, regular world map? No, I'm doing a uh, community world because that's probably the the map that Justin will run into the most, playing no moving and gold and silver and whatnot when he, <laughs> while he's while he's ranking. So it's oh, all no, about do, that. Do you rank? I'm assuming you do, right? Um, yeah. Until you get to you have to play 20, 20 games a week until you get to champs, and then if you're in champs, you can just not play and. I think you're okay, depending yeah. on where your rating is. Yeah, I guess we're playing again. I, I've been on like a it's been like a two week break for me ever since Dark and Darker fucking exploded. Yeah, it's all good. <laughs> you'll you'll have a lot more knowledge now. Hell yeah! So this one's weird. We'll we have this square pole. Mm -hmm. We have the square pole with the holes in it. Yeah, yeah. And it looks so 
it's, everything looks tie. That little red roof looks tie and everything too. Mm -hmm. Just that, that pole looks so short with these tall palms in the middle of nowhere. I can't stop thinking about Sri Lanka. Mm -hmm. They're the only other ones around here that would have these sort of square poles. Yeah, yeah. Also, like just the the cable management on that pole is making me crazy. It's wild. It's <laughs> <laughs> a lot going on. I have a I have a photo album somewhere of just crazy uh like rat king of wires I've seen all over. That's a big <laughs> India thing too. Yeah, yeah. Um, where do I, where do I really want to lay this? That's wild. I mean, both work. I think I will go through with how short this pole is too. Yeah, about it. All right, fuck everything else looks tied up. <laughs> or at least it could be. It's a place where I I trick myself with a lot. This is one of those locations where I'd probably be better off doing an MPZ 10 second timer where I don't don't even think and I get it like yeah, you gotta snap really aside. close. Mm -hmm. Now I've overthought it, so. <laughs> this transformer too, I can't get out of my head. Hmm. I see, I was thinking about that too. That'd be a crazy one. Mm -hmm. So one of the countries around here, JHK just mentioned it. Mm -hmm. Uh VNTN is the the capital of uh Lao, which is north of Thai. North and east of Thai, and oh, the yeah. only the only place in this country where they don't have uh, a recognizable Google car because the blur actually works correctly is in and around the capital. That wouldn't be a bad shout either. You know, I'm just gonna guess there just for fun. <laughs> That's right. I'll throw in Sri Lanka. And it hey, was there. Look at that. that was a good shout. I considered that too. Where is it though? Oh, it's right on the border. That makes sense. There's a little it. tongue That's of it awesome. right by the border. All right, I could do I could do one more. My JHK is the goat. And then I gotta I gotta whisk away to dark and darker with uh, sounds good. Ryan and them. And we are in a random Russia. Random Russia. Yep. So what uh? I, what gives that away? So for me, it's because I've played way too much Russia. No, <laughs> <Fair>. um, <laughs> but actually, could this be a, a weird Ukraine? And we have some signs that could work in both. No, I think I still go fresh. Wait. This road, though, that double white line is making me... It's making me weirded out. <laughs> um, Yeah, you got to go, though, so... I think I'm up. I think I'm up. I'm being bothered now. <laughs> This is why you never say you're good at a country, because then uh -huh. if it comes up and you don't get it, you get fucking... Everyone makes fun of you. Oh, no. No, I don't feel Russia enough for this one. This, this yeah. is more of a Polish feel with that line, which makes me want to go to Ukraine. I'm going to. Okay. And I'm going to go... I'm going northwest of Zhytomyr. I'll slam it in there. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. And we healed. Beautiful. <laughs> no one has to win this duel because it's just a learning process anyway. Yeah. Well, shit. Thank you so much for doing this with me. I, no problem. I would love we to could do, do this, more of this again anytime, anytime. Yeah. Hell yeah. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Oh, that next drop's so good too. The guy flexing at the ocean. Fuck. Hell yeah. Oh yeah. That's it. <laughs> that's another fun that's thing. That's gonna be me when I'm winning here. all my Geo games. Hell yes. <laughs> uh, thanks. Every, this is Beirut, I think. By the way. That's cool. Rare, rare drop. Hell yeah. Thanks for having me. Have fun yeah. with the rest of your stream. Thank you. Thank you I so will, much. Uh, I'll do this again soon. Sounds good, man. All right. Take care. Bye-bye, chat. Peace. Uh, that fucking rocked. Hell yeah. Everyone, make sure you check out Michael here. One of my favorite streams to chill in. So let me try a little spot of Geo. A tiny spot of GeoGuessr. A quick Geo and the Magic Card 6 p.m. So we're playing No Move. We're going to play a little No Move. Playing Hot and Loose. Yep.
So I didn't retain a lot of my power line knowledge, but like we didn't really I didn't really have too many drops here today with uh with Michael. I think we're in Thailand though. I'm gonna drop it. That's nah, fine. Uh yeah, as soon as I make my guess, feel free to say whatever you want. Just uh no helping, please, chat. Or if there's like five seconds left on the timer, you could say some shit because I can't really see it in time. Oh. Very clearly. In Singapore. <laughs> Hopefully somehow they don't know this. <laughs> but we had the same info. Although now that I started the clock, they could try to pinpoint it better, you know? I just dropped it in Singapore. I'm shocked. The barco. Huh. Yeah, I'm not really sure. I'm gonna put it around here. Ah, we both thought the same thing. He just grabbed a lake in uh, Argentina. It was Bolivia. I don't know which area you can see. Oh, H fuck. buff one, H buff two, H buff three. This is uh, fuck. I haven't played in a bit, but I think this is Ghana. Where's this Senegal? No, this is Ghana, right? Yo, Mungu, happy 77 months. It was Ghana, just opposite side. All right, all right. First game of the of the week. I got some uh, GeoGuessr lessons today from my buddy Mike Mhud on Twitch. He's a part of Chapo FYM, and he's uh, incredible at GeoGuessr. Dude is a wealth of fucking cool knowledge. I love hanging out in an Mhud stream. Like he he typically streams early and is just doing cool shit. I just watch when I'm getting like ready for my day. Yeah, like genuinely one of the best. Huh. Are we out here somewhere? Split the difference. <laughs> it's Denmark. Ah, Veg equals road in Denmark, Norway. I see. I couldn't make much out. I freaked out. Huh. Well. 
Is this like a... Out here? Was this the Chechia thing? It might have been, I don't know. I, I'm just going based off the tile roofs. I got a little 30 there. The street's called that. We'll see. The ladders to the roofs are wild. We're both wrong, it was Finland. I, I, I'm glad we were both extremely wrong. did much better though. Yo, what's up? I figure I got a little bit before I open these magic packs. I'll I'll see I'll see if I retained. I would love to do that again sometime soon. It's fucking genuinely one of my favorite things I've done on stream in a long time. I'm a little lost here. Got a little stone house up there. Yeah, hell yeah, Dave. somewhere oh both the way off Italy I was more off than them though. <laughs> I didn't know what to do for that one <clears throat> whoa car okay. I don't know where to go. I'm freaking out. I don't know what to do. I'm just throwing it down some. Wow, I was actually much closer. Jesus. I kept thinking I think it's Brazil, but then I uh, I was like I don't know where the fuck it's this flat in Brazil. I'm gonna send another. That's two in a row. Two in a row. But yeah, if y'all keep your speculation and guesses and stuff until uh, after I've hit my lock in. I'm trying to not read chat too, though, until I lock in. Just in case. I know it becomes rough. Well, we've got a big pipe. And that's about all we got. Big pipe. Nice trees. I don't know what to make of that sun. I guess we're like slightly in the southern hemisphere. Oh, I got this big pipe. Big old pipe. Hmm. Also, it's a rhetorical question where they got all this pipe. Shit. There's a big pipe. Hmm. I 
I really don't know on this one. I feel like it's going to be, uh... Hmm. <laughs> I just, I, like, I'm just, like, kind of essentially torn along the whole fucking equator. I mean, it's not that trop. I mean... No, I don't know. Fuck. This is a brutal one. The southern, uh, southern hemisphere, southern hemisphere. The old southern equator. Yeah, I don't... I don't think I know the utility poles at all. Well... Fuck. I'm gonna put it... I'm gonna put it somewhere down here. We were both insanely wrong. <laughs> Thailand. I almost went Indonesia, so I would have been much closer if I did that. Really hard time seeing what the lettering is. It's not out there, is it? about I don't think it's the like I don't The top ones are really throwing me off. I mean, it's all throwing me off quite a bit. It's not, I don't think it's out there at all. Is Myanmar mapped? I don't even know if it is. see a Bambarella, you know? I feel like I have not seen a Bambarella, though. Could it be over here? I don't think so. It doesn't look... out here? No. I'm just making sure I'm not... Alright. I really don't know. I feel like I want to throw it out here. It'd be nice if I could find uh, Bambarella or the other one. Just like I feel good about it, you know? Oh. 
I'm just gonna drop it in there and get this moving. Neither of us guessed. It was Sri Lanka. Okay. <laughs> really, Michael? There. Oh, it sucks, Dave. Doing some no move. Hey, so. Uh. this would track I'm gonna throw it down here and just see what happens I don't know if I'm right the other part of me had me thinking Jordan <laughs> oh look at this uh... oh wow that was Idaho. Did we both guess the same exact area? Idaho. It could be, but I've, I mean, it was just a, uh, they were probably also just trying to gleam info. I should be able to place it off those poles, but hmm. I'm having a hard time remembering utility pole stuff. I'm assuming it's these maybe on each one. Or maybe just how those triangle at the top. I mean, I have a good general idea as to where it is. Just not like, you know, not specifically. I wish I could make this out a little better. I feel like I'm gonna throw it in Malaysia. I was gonna see what happens in Malaysia. Oh, baby. Wow. Okay. Okay. Black stick on the round pull like that is mainland Malaysia. Okay, okay. Too sure here at all. It's got to be Europe, right? I mean, don't don't answer these. Oh, hmm. hmm. Ah, fuck. Ooh, what am I thinking? It's like, ah, fuck. I don't think it is going to be up here. 
It was way down there, Serbia. Oh, painful. I had no fucking clue on that one. Oh, hmm. I don't want to get completely thrown off by these. I don't know what else I would guess. Oh, they're sending it. It doesn't feel like it. Like, it doesn't feel like, uh... Singapore. Maybe it's outside of it. Maybe it's like up here somewhere. It's up there. I think I might get a little cooked here. easy one to learn yeah let me know once I lock it in I'm not super sure uh, where's a I'm trying to gleam again with the Sun And this means we're southern hemisphere. Yeah. I'm not sure if I want to put it down here. If I want to go further up here, maybe. Ecuador, even. I'm gonna go out here. Well, I shouldn't guess there, because I don't see, like, a little river running near me. I should be a little, at least not put it on a river. Yeah, I could be anywhere in here. Just throw it in there. Car meta strong for this one? What's up with the car? Oh, it's Puerto Rico. Oh, Dominican Republic. Oh, that killed me. Oh, okay, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Alright, I'm gonna try one more and then I'm gonna start setting up for cards. Hard setup going. Okay. It's hard for me to remember the car stuff. Like, I'm not sure what this, uh, like I don't know if this car is a giveaway. Well, they're sending it. Fuck. I got no clue on this one. No fucking clue. I don't. I have no idea where to put it. It was all right. It's Peru. I got to see how long the pack opening takes me. I also I have to be up uh, very early tomorrow, and I did not know it. So depending on how long pack opening goes, will be uh, if I am playing. But if I am playing, I also am not sure. I have so many to pick from now. So I could really pick. I've got like six to choose from. I bought Mothman today, but I am in no rush to play Mothman. Ah, oh, fuck.
Well, shit. Am I out here somewhere? Nope. <laughs> we were both way off, and it was Spain. That's funny that we guessed in the same spot. I gotta start learning the pavements. I'll get there. Hmm. We got nothing else to work off of here, huh? Doorbell rang right as they go. Oh, someone leaving a package. Fuck. Ah, uh, shit. We somewhere out here. No nope, way off. It was Bolivia. Yo, let's go, DBJ. I'm gonna be opening packs after. I'm gonna start opening stuff after this game. I think that package that just showed up is my. Uh, Service bulls? <laughs> oh yeah. Fuck. 23. Where do they have uh, highways that look like this? This is not Australia. Is this some New Zealand shit? It's some New Zealand shit. There's 23. Raglan and Hamilton. Where? Why tuna? I'm gonna put it right here. Yes, hell yeah, DBJ. Yo, what's up, Chibli? Four. Let's go. You're born on this road. Oh, 5k. It just took me a minute. Alright, I'm lost here. I don't know what's going on with that. We got the little tiny antenna, so I'm assuming it's EU. We got tall trees, so I'm feeling like Finland. I'm just, I'm getting there. I'm just gonna fucking, I'm snapping it in. I'm gonna freak them out. I'm freaking it into Finland. I'm <laughs> sending it. I'm freaking. I see tall, thin trees. The pressure didn't work so well, but it also wasn't the worst. <laughs> Ooh. In America, huh? Definitely the Pacific Northwest. East 20, but it's like a little shield. Each state's gonna have their own little different highways in a shield, right? I'm just gonna put it, I'm just gonna drop it up here and see what happens. I'm sending it. That's fair. I do ask no one, uh... Oh, God. That single one did it. Let's go. I'm gonna end on a high note. I gotta get ready to open my, uh, open my little pack.